up you guys Mako here welcome back to another video and today I will be reviewing what I like about the Mustang and what I hate about the Mustang or what I hate about my Mustang okay so first thing what I like about it is I like the RTR lights that it has those are very nice those look you know make it look a little different from the bumper you know from the front side and another thing that i like about this car is the brembo brakes these brakes work really good every time when i'm speed well when i'm in mexico every time when i'm in mexico and i have to stop really fast at a light you know they'll they'll hook they'll hook to them brakes and you know i'll stop in like a quick second you know i like the rims another thing that i like about the car is i like the rims the performance pack rims they're gloss black rims i think they're 19 inch rims gloss black and i like it has the little pony logo in the middle but i do plan on getting some other rims later on hopefully you know hopefully i get them later on um you know i gotta explore my options first you know hopefully i get another another rims i want some concave ones the ones that you know go inside the ones that i'm, I'm not sure how to explain it they go like I'm not sure the kind of rims that you know that that are I'm not sure how to explain it <laughs> but it's like concave rims there they go there they go like inside but I'm not sure if I'm explaining myself right and well these got to go so I'm gonna have to change those a little bit and what I like the most is that I have these borlas right here another thing that I like about this Mustang is I got the quad tips, one, two, and then I got three, four right here. So I like the how I got the Borla exhaust. I got the active exhaust too also. I'm not sure if you guys can see in there pretty well. Hopefully you can. Well, I got the active exhaust. You know, I got to clean this exhaust. I'm not sure if you guys can see that pretty good. Um, I like how... The performance pack it comes with this spoiler you know it brings it gives me some downforce to it and um I, I like this very much it comes you know the base model mustangs they don't come with this spoiler and this you know this gives it a whole different look to the back end of the mustang so i like the performance pack rims this is gonna be a really quick video because i mean not too many too much stuff i like everything about the car i don't have any downsides to it but the only thing that i really don't like about the car is that bumper i wish that bumper could come differently i don't like those these little lines right here i wish they could have you know redesigned those lines or made it to like an open vent or something i like the gt500 bumper how they look on these cars but hopefully i'll get a gt500 bumper and put that put it on that car rewrap my car how it used to have it you know get it back right but mainly that's the only thing that i really don't like about it i mean it's not too bad looking but it's not too bad looking but i do i really don't like how it looks on the car i mean it just looks too plain and simple but i'm gonna go ahead and go on the inside of the car so we're on the inside of the car now and what i like about this car on the inside is you guys you guys should already know it is the digital dash okay so i love the digital dash because it looks very nice at night you know you can adjust the my color you have very all different options you go from green yellow orange whatever you have different options of the my color and i got the heated steering wheel i got the I got the heated and cool seats I got the all these toggle switches right here. Don't mind the don't mind the gum. But I got these toggle switches. I got the emergency light. Oh, I think I had them. Oh, there we go. I thought I had them on for a second, but I got the traction control. I got the steering steering mode fields. And I got the driving mode. So I got the track, drag strip mode, and I got the different types of modes track drag strip mode and sports plus mainly i drive in sports plus when i do a little racing i'll probably drive in drag strip mode but that's kind of dangerous because it, it will lose traction i guess 
every time you upshift it'll like it'll every time you upshift on the car on drag strip mode it'll like push pull, pull the vehicle like forward causing it to lose traction i guess you could you know hydroplane or lose traction if you know you don't have very good tires and that has happened to me once and i almost you know i lost control of the car well i re i had regained control back of the car luckily there was no cars right beside me but i was racing somebody and i had in drag strip mode and i upshifted and i guess you know i lost traction and um i just started spinning out but i had regained control of the car and you know nothing happened so uh another thing that i like about this car would be the 10 speed automatic so i got you know people were telling me to get the manual and stuff but i i couldn't do that because i i don't have nothing against manuals but the 10 speed automatic you know they go through the, they go through them gears like quick they go through them gears like one two three four five six seven eight nine, they go fast and another thing that i like about this car is the sound system the sound system right here so I got the bow sound system. Well, I'm not sure how what's it called. It's called the B and O. I think it's bow. It's called bow system. But I'm not sure what what it's called, B and O or bow system. But you got a pretty good pretty good size subwoofer in the back. You know, it'll get the mirror shaking. I'll be bumping into my music and everybody looking staring at me on the, on the side of the. Uh, the what's that called what's that light called at uh, the stoplight <laughs> man i keep forgetting some stuff you know I, i'm too nervous that's when i get nervous i forget what to say in my videos but when i have especially when i have an audience you know i get a little nervous but that that should go away that should go away with time um i really like a lot of stuff about the mustang there's really you know not too much what i really don't like about the mustang is that i wish i wish that they had um these little lights right here i wish they would come like led lights you know white lights instead of those ugly orange lights especially where how you have them everywhere around here you got orange light right there orange light on the top you know i wish they would come led lights white lights so you know they flash brighter and they look better but you know it comes but you know it, it's all good the mustang is a very good good car you know it's very reliable i like how how fast it is you know i got about 465 horsepower i believe if not you know don't get on me <laughs> i don't I know it has more than 400 horses. I got more than four, four. I I believe I have 465. But yeah, let let me show you a little bit about the digital dash. Let me see. I'm gonna turn it on. I like how that little pony logo pops up as soon as you turn it on. And there there's your digital dash. Right now I got it as green on the outside and red on the inside. As you can see, you have very different options. You can go to my mode. You click this little pony right here you go to you you go to this screen called my mode well not my mode but you have these different types of options you know this is where i can this is where i could um you know adjust my exhaust settings if i go to exhaust mode i can go to quiet i can go to normal mode sport mode and track mode track mode is the loudest you know it sounds the best but if you're trying to be quiet, you know, trying to be sneaky or trying to, you know, not be too loud or wake up the neighbors, put it in quiet mode. Also, you can put it for, uh, I'm going to leave it at track mode because, you know, I like to be loud. You know, I like to annoy people in the morning times. But if you, uh, you got your track apps right here. Also, you got your acceleration timer, your brake performance and your lap timer. And also you got a start option. Well, you know you can automatically start you know or the drag race countdown it'll go from the red light to the yellow light to the green light or racetrack well oh let me change that back yeah and then it'll go and then once it turns green you can go ahead and you know do your zero to 60 miles 
And here's my gauges. I also have different types of gauges up here. Please oh. say a command. What did I push? Oh, I pushed the voice. I didn't get that. Yeah, I pushed the voice command by accident. Well, and also, oh, here's also my color. You go to my color, you can adjust, you know, your primary color, which is that this green color right here. And also your secondary color would be, you know, your your red color, these these little red colors down here. I'm not sure if you can see it. Ambient light, I got ambient light all around the car, you know. I could change it to different types of colors. Let me see if I can show you what kind of colors. Okay, so this all the colors are the same for all all the other options for the primary color, secondary color, ambient light. So that I got ice blue, I got gray, I got green, I got purple. I got blue, orange, red, and also you, you have the option to do my color. You know, you, you can do presets of what what you want on your car. So like I was saying, you can do presets of what you want on your car and stuff like that. You know, you can have whatever colors you want. And I mean, I mean, it's a pretty sharp car. With the premium package, you get everything fully loaded. You get the sound system. You get the my color, the digital dash, active exhaust. You're gonna get you get everything with it. I got the performance pack. I got everything with it. So I'm not sure. If, I'm pretty sorry if it's a long video, but I just had to go through. You know what I like about the Mustang. I didn't have a lot of cons about it, but I mean, overall, the Mustang is a very good vehicle. I would highly recommend you to get a Mustang um they're very fast they're reliable and they're very i like how you know they're very stylish you know as you can say but i'm gonna go ahead and end this video i'll see you guys on the next video hopefully it'll be something me installing something on the car but I'll see you guys on the next video leave a like hit that subscribe button and also share it to other people you know so we can get this channel growing i'll see you guys on the next video mako out